back to manifestation budget so i hope you're all doing really well today we're going to be doing a bit of a bonus cash stuffing um so my bills come out on the first of each month and also on the 18th of each month um, and obviously i'm getting used to my new budget and stuff like that so what's basically happened is i've got to the point now where um obviously all the bills and stuff for the month have come out and then i've been able to work out what we've got left so this is bonus cash um that we are going to put into some savings challenges and yeah just to see how we get on so we'll give it a count up it's all in fibers which is perfect for this type of video so we've got 5 10 15 20 25 30 35 40 45 50 55 60 65 70 75 80 85 90 95 105 and 10 so £110 going into savings challenges and we're going to do a combination of different ones. So we're just going to start off with Studio Budget Lane because we really want to get going with this. Now we've completed, is it two or three we've completed so far? So we've done Bookshop, we've done scratch -a latte and we've done Flower Shop. Um, so yeah, it's just between these. So we've got one, two, three, four, five. So we're going to roll a dice. Let um, obviously that decides which one we do. If we roll a six, we'll just roll again. So two. So we're going to go first to ready or not. Here I crumb. Ready or not, I mean. And we need our spinner, which is just in this drawer here. Somewhere. Bear with me. There we go. Okay, so we're going to give that a little spin. We need our red sharpie and it's a selection of buns and I think, is that supposed to be a six? Yeah, that's a six. Okay, so we'll do the six and then is, is there any fours left? Yeah, we'll do these. So we'll just round it up to ten. That's going to be the easiest way to do it. Got this here for now. So we've got five and ten going in there. So let's see what we've got so far. 25, 35, 36. So we look like we're about halfway on that one. So that's fine. And then we will roll again. So number one, which is the fast food. So let's have a look. Purple, so we're using a purple for this, and we could do three and two, which is five. So, what have we got in here so far? We'll add the five to it, so we've got 10, 22 in there so far. Just means that we can bulk these up a little bit and hopefully get them completed sooner rather than later. So, four, one, two three and four which is toy shop now this is the one that saves quite a lot and we've not got very far with it yet so we really do need to get going so we're supposed to roll a colored dice for this um it's this one so a pink is two uh, let's get the green so we've got pink which is two let's go again oh pink again so that's four and yellow which is five so it's nine and then is there a one a blue yeah so we'll do um let's do the blue here okay so that's ten going in toy shop so five and ten so that's ten twenty five twenty six in there so far And then we'll go again. Four, is that the same again? One, two, three, four. Right, okay. That's fine. We do need quite a lot on this one, so I don't mind too much doing a few of those. So we've got a pink again, so that's two. Purple, which is four, so that's six. Yellow, which is five, so that's what, 11. So if we do 
11 and then if we do another four which is purple that makes 15 then doesn't it so five 10 and 15 so we've got 10 20 30 41 in there now okay um, we're going to roll again if not we're going to do oh pet shop which is what i wanted to do so let's have a go at this um as you will have seen from previous videos i did get one of the the dodgy stickers <laughs> so yeah you're gonna have to bear with me so we'll do 15 5 10 and 15 and we'll do this little fish okay pop our little fish on there so we've got three more to go on there. So let's count up the money. So we've got 20, 30, 5, 45 in pet shop. And then I think we'll just pop over to cut and blow dry because pet shops had some, toy shops had some. This one's not had any. Again, I'm not good with the coin flip. Uh, where is my coin actually? I'm just going to throw it up in the air scissors again every single time we've got scissors what are the chances of that so we've completed that first row and that'd be five so we've got 30 pounds in total because it's been five all the way down the first line which is crazy okay how much have we got left 5 10 15 20 25 30 35 40 45 50 so I think we'll go on to Magic Binder for the rest of this money. And again, we've completed a couple of these and they've now come out. So we've got one, two, three, and four. So if we roll a five or a six, we'll roll again. So we've got three, one, two, three. So that's I am free. I might just put the fivers in for now. We'll do it like this. Three again. Two, move them up a little bit. Number one, go again. Four, one, two, three, and four. Roll again. Four again. These are going into the iris binder when they're done. So two, which is this one, go again, four, which is this one again, go again, four, oh, four is popular today, and again, six we don't have, Whoop, six we don't have, four again, right, I'm not going to do four because they only go up in tens, we don't have a six, two. So that's in this one. So there we go. So let's get our green again. Oh, it's here. Okay, so the first one from Sephiris Digitals is getting just a five today. Oops, oh, knocking everything up. So that's just one little Draco. So there's now in this challenge a total of 10, 20, 35. So pop the money in that way and pop the challenge in. So still quite a way to go for this one, but that's okay. And then we've got £15 going into the beans challenge. So we can cross off one, two, and a three beans. And then let's see how much we've got in total. So we've got 25, 30. Five, forty. Forty now in the beans challenge. Again, that one's still got quite a way to go, but it's okay. We will get there. We will get there. Then we've got ten pounds going into the sock one. So we've got five and 
10. So now in total in there, we've got 20 and 30. That's fine. So yeah, hopefully we can finish these by the end of the summer, I'm hoping. And then this one now has got 20 going in, so we can cross two off because this is the only one that each icon is 10. So we'll cross off this little wand here and spell book here. So there's £30 left to go in that one. 20, 30, 40 now in there. And that's that, that's all the money gone. So it doesn't last very long, but it's bulked up a lot of the savings challenges. So my idea is, obviously, when this is complete, these four challenges will go into the iris binder, which is great. And then that will be for like sinking funds and stuff. Um, studio budget lane, again, when they're complete, we're going to wait for them all to be complete before we reallocate. And again, it will be um, sinking funds and potentially going back into... Um, possibly into a holiday binder so i've set up a new holiday binder i'll just flick through that now because it's obviously just a short video so when i finished the summer challenges in here um i took them all out and i decided to make it into a bit of a holiday binder so i've just got a little envelope in there just so we know it's a holiday binder i'm going to do that i know what you did this summer from little moon budgets but obviously i can do that at the end of the summer i've got the lovely bunch of coconuts challenge that i didn't do um before the summer i'm going to also do crack the code and that's also from little moon budgets um, hot hot heat again little moon budgets i've got the panda pop in there from sarah at dilly dally budgets i've got show me the candy from that budget looks and i've got fiber friday which was from the budgeting bear who no longer has a shop unfortunately so i'm just going to get on with these challenges really just to make it a little bit more fun than just filling out uh, one tracker for a holiday envelope just thought putting some games in will make it a lot better so yeah we'll work through those there's no rush for this uh, but obviously we are going to look at booking a holiday soon um, and I've also got this from Cashbook Q because I do really want to go to Disney but we're not going to start that one just yet but this is going to be my holiday binder going forward uh, but we're not going to start on those just now um, and then yeah and then I've just got obviously my main challenges binder I've decided the angel numbers saver is going to go towards getting us all new passports so need to continue with that one uh, rock paper scissors is just our spending money um, each week and when that's complete that will go into a sinking fund um, and same with this one whatever challenge we do from little moon budgets and then the pumpkin picking is for autumn um, and the fiver saver again is just to go into either um sinking funds or to save for something that's coming up so yeah that is where i'm up to at the moment thank you so much for joining me for yet another video um, and i'll catch you all in my next one take care guys bye